Hello viewers welcome back on my YouTube channel. In this video I will tell you about series The Acolyte Season 1 Episode 7 Story. So don't skip the video The Acolyte. This episode will be a flashback episode that provides more context to the story before the finale. Episode 7 is expected to reveal the truth about Brendock's tragic events. Kimir's past will be explored, including his training and who his master was. The relationship between Osha and Kimir will be further explored, with the latter continuing his corruption of the former. Saul will finally tell me the truth about what happened on Brendock. The episode will delve deeper into the mystery of the Sith and their motivations. Begins with Osha coming to and sitting up, much like the previous episode. Saul, accompanied by Mei who is masquerading as Osha, tries to contact Karuskin to inform them about what happened on Kofar. The real Osha is on Kimir's island base, where he attempts to seduce her to the dark side. Vernestra tries to fend off a Senate inquiry into the murders committed by Mei, while investigating the fate of Saul's non-council or Senate-sanctioned expedition. Saul doesn't notice that Mei isn't Osha, and Basil doesn't tell him about the imposter for a while. Saul's ship experiences a communications disruption, which prevents him from revealing the deep, dark Jedi secret. Osha and the stranger Kimir share a moment where their faces are close together, and Osha grabs his lightsaber. The stranger tells Osha that she should draw on her pain and attachment, which the Jedi considered a weakness the Acolyte Season 1 Episode 7 review in comment box. 